Hi, I'm Richard Scarf, and I'm Director of Operations here at the Royal Free Charity and we're incredibly lucky throughout the Trust in that we have a diverse and active team of volunteers. One of the greatest pleasures in my role is to see volunteers of all ages make a difference every day. None more so than our younger people, 16 to 25 year olds who constantly surprise us with their innovative ways of supporting the Trust through their own social action. And here are just a couple of examples. Hi, I'm Melina and welcome to my Dementia Friends session at the Royal Free. I started volunteering when I was 17 because I knew that I wanted to go into medicine and had been told the Royal Free Charity had a very good young volunteer scheme. It was great to be 17 and be part of a large knowledgeable body of people and to feel that you have an important part to play with real responsibility. I loved it here so much that after my first year I was nominated to be an ambassador for the I Will campaign. This has led me to be the first young person to volunteer in a &E and also to become a dementia champion. I feel that the Young Volunteers programme has shaped my future and helped me put something back into the NHS and hopefully when I qualify as a doctor that can continue. Hi, I'm Brad and I've done a lot. I'm Australian but I've lived in New Zealand, South America, mainland Europe and now here in London. The one thing I've done in each country is volunteer. Now as the Young Volunteer Programme Coordinator, I use all that experience to get our young people making a difference. When I started at Barnet Hospital a year ago, we only had five volunteers under the age of 25, but I was lucky to have the Royal Free Charity Young Volunteer Programme as a foundation. So with a little bit of hard work and a little bit of personality, it took only seven months to raise that number to 100. That's 100 young people making a difference to the hospital, its patients and its staff members. I think the reason for the program's success is, first off, the relationship between the charity and the hospital, and also the incredible enthusiasm of the young people. I've had such a great time here and I really feel I've made a difference. But every now and again, I still go and sit with the patients and share a cup of tea. When I see the young volunteers working so hard with fun and humility, I realise how important a programme like this is. Young people will amaze you, you just have to give them the chance. Our success has been down to the trust and the charity putting their faith in those youngsters with a well-resourced and a structured programme. And it's great to see a group of young people asking not what can the NHS do for them, but what can they do for their NHS.